This one about the Roman Colosseum is an extended exercise in parallelism. Parallelism is one of the GMAT's favorite constructions. So here we have to have parallelism between the two verbs. We have the, the subject, construction, and we have begun and was completed. So here we have construction began, but then we don't have the word and joining, and we need a joining word. So without the word and, this is incorrect. In B, we have begun a participle. Participle is not in parallel to a verb, so that's incorrect. C, we have begun in 69 AD and was completed. Perfectly correct. That does the parallelism correctly. D, officially known and begun, so it puts two different things in parallel. And, and it was completed, so this is not correct. This, this disrupts the parallelism, puts the wrong things in parallel. E, officially known, which was begun and was completed, that is also correctly in parallel. So C and E both construct the parallelism correctly. The only problem with E is, Notice that we have construction of the, the Colosseum, officially known as blah, which was begun and was completed, blah, blah, blah. And we go all the way to the end of the sentence and we never get a verb. So the subject construction does not have a verb. And in fact, E is just a gigantic sentence fragment without an independent verb. Whereas in C, what we have is construction began and was completed. That's the core part of the sentence. So we have a core noun, a core verb. Everything is properly in parallel. C is free of grammatical errors, and it is by far the best answer choice.